people. Welcome back to Live Life Lovely with me, Lakeisha. Today, I am so excited. I am participating in a $5 DIY collab with the wonderful Miss Auntie Cuckoo. And the title of her collaboration is Pumpkin Palooza. I really, really like that. So the challenge is to do a DIY project for only $5 um, for the fall. So I chose, since it's Pumpkin Palooza, I had to make something pumpkin. So I chose to make a DIY uh, pumpkin using toilet paper. <laughs> so I hope you like um, this video. If you do, please like and subscribe and hit that wonderful notification bell so you can get a little ding every time I upload a video and um, hit it twice so you can see me twice as much. All right, thank you so much and I hope you enjoy. Bye. Isn't this pumpkin so cute? I'm going to make this today with only a few materials. So I went to Walmart to get some fabric. You don't have to use fabric, you can also use paper, but I love the patterns here and they were only $2 a yard, um, I'm sorry, $4 a yard, so I ended up getting two half yard cuts and so that came up to $2 a piece. So out of my $5, I have already spent $4 on my wonderful fabric, but I think it is so very cute. Um, in addition to that fabric, I've also purchased from the Dollar Tree four um, pieces, not pieces, but four tissue paper rolls because we're going to use both of those in this DIY. Um, since I ran out of money, I also um, had some other materials that I brought in from outside that I will be using with this project. So the first thing I did was cut my half um, yard into quarters so I can get four pumpkins out of this um, fabric. That's right, four pumpkins are coming out of this wonderful $5 DIY. And I went outside to get some leaves and I also went outside to get some branches from the tree to make the stem and to um, embellish the pumpkin a little. But you can make those with um, fabric, you can make those with paper. Um, it the sky's the limit. So you put the toilet paper roll in the middle of the fabric and then you start to stuff the fabric corners in. Now I can tell you this is the part that's a little tricky. You have to try to make it as round as possible. So some people to make this round they cover the toilet paper roll with a bag or they cover it with some additional um, fabric but I chose to just use the pumpkin and then just work it until it looks sort of round. So that's what I'm doing here. This is so simple, guys. Children can do this. Um, this could be a project at school. Um, it could be a gift idea. And so you just fluff it out. So I'm fluffing it out, I'm playing with this. Uh, as you can see, the bottom here is flat, but the top is shaping up. And I'm gonna continue to play with it a little bit here until it's all um, to my satisfaction. And then I'm gonna take the branch I got from the tree outside and just stuff it in the middle. Guys, this is so cute. Doesn't that look exactly like a pumpkin? So now I am just decorating it with some leaves I got. Um, and these leaves actually came from, I don't think this, these came from a tree. They came from like um, some weeds of a plant I had. So I didn't feel guilty like snatching these off. But again, a lot of people choose paper. But it brings the natural outdoors into the home. So I was very satisfied with this. So I like this a lot. And it was only... Um, five dollars for the whole DIY and look how long it took me to do it uh hello it only took like two minutes to put together so um, that's my first one my second one is uh, the same thing but with the other fabric that I purchased I actually like this one better because I had gotten the hang of making the pumpkin by the time I got to this one. And I'm not going to show you all four, but I did make four. So I made two of the checkered patterns and I made two of the um, leaf patterns. So again, I'm stuffing this all the way down in the hole at the top. And now I am going to shape it out. And um, this one was, I don't know, the fabric was a little different or something, but this one was easier to shape. I, I like the way this one turned out a little better than the first one. Um, but for whatever reason, 
it's super cute now that looks more round and so I took a branch and stuck it in there but um, I realized it was like too thin so I put two hey you can do what you want it's your DIY project whatever makes you happy and now I'm just adding a leaf for embellishment look at that that is so cute guys like this is so easy to do and I got this idea off Pinterest it was so simple so I'm playing around with this a little bit, but um, instead of using the branch from outside, you can totally roll up some fabric and like stick it in the middle, some brown fabric, and stick it in the middle, and um, that will work just as much. So again, here is um, another pumpkin that I'm putting together, and I'm just going to um, speed this one up a little. And that was it guys very very easy so now I'm going to show you a picture of it in my um, master bathroom I put two in a basket and I put two on top of my tile holder um, for all my towels and it just turned out really nice and I want to do way more of these so thank you so much for um, watching everyone. I hope this inspires you to get started for uh, the fall. And remember everyone, life is as lovely as you make it. Talk to you next time. Bye! Hold me close till I get up Time is barely on our side